Hi, um, it's not usually my practice to show stuff off half finished, but I just got this thing strung up and it sounds amazing. Um, you can see that it, it really needs heaps of work still. I mean, I haven't even cut the frets down all the way down the board, as you can see. They're still sticking up there, ready to shred someone's hands. And the whole thing's looking a bit unfinished and unpolished, but um, it sounds really nice. I just built it out of scraps I had lying around after another project, so there's a hardwood stake for the neck. The fingerboard is a little strip of red Tasmanian oak, um, just a piece of trim. There's two leftover tuning pegs I had from another job, and the lengths of fret wire I used, including up at the nut here, which has a zero fret and then two little finishing nails to hold the strings out, which is a design I stole from Tiny Guitars. Again, that was just that these fret pieces are just offcuts from the last job I did. Anyway, and the um, the resonator is a tin can that was used for holding sweets, and the bridge is just a crappy little block of wood. The tailpiece is a uh, a bulldog clip that I sort of hammered out flat using a clamp, and you can see the way it grips the um, grips the ball end strings. Anyway, it's tuned a fifth apart in G and C, and the fretting pattern, as you can see, isn't like the guitar, it uses dulcimer fretting, so it's, it's uh, stepped in whole tones. And it's really loud, too. It's actually probably the first instrument I can play recognizable music on. About the only things I don't like about it, or that need a little bit more work, is it could probably do with some um, stabilization for the back of the neck so that the neck doesn't rotate. At the moment, as you can see, there's nothing here. Um, that would be a good addition. And I can't really think of anything else I'd change on it. There was something, but I've forgotten what it is now. Anyway, there you go, maybe a third string.